Hello everyone, Sigmalator here. Welcome back to Silent Hill 2. Lot of graves out here. And a lot of collectibles. That's all good. That's the door I came through, isn't it? Yeah, I came through here, so... Where do I go? Deep hole here, but nothing inside. Ah, here we go. Another hole to jump down. A lot of long, ominous hallways. Oh dear. That's not a good sign. Oh, hey, Eddie. What have you done? What are you doing? What does it look like? He always busted my balls. You fat, disgusting piece of shit. You make me sick. Fat ass, you're nothing but a waste of skin. You're so ugly, even your mama don't love you. Well, maybe he was right. Maybe I am nothing but a fat, disgusting piece of shit. But you know what? It doesn't matter if you're smart, dumb, Ugly, pretty, it's all the same once you're dead. That is true, but corpse can't laugh. yet that is crossing a line. If anyone makes fun of me, I'll kill him just like that. Eddie, have you gone nuts? Not the smart thing to say, James. I knew it. You too. You're just like him, James. Hey, I didn't mean anything. Don't bother. I understand. You've been laughing at me all along, haven't you? Ever since we first met. I'll kill you, James. Ooh, right. Uh, right, let's reload you. Reload you, and then let's get this out. Alright, that's that part of it done, I think. Rifle shells, thank you. Okay. Right. Only four shells, right. That's how much it carries. Need to keep an eye on that. Eddie? Yeah, I killed that dog. 
It was fun. It tried to chew its own guts out. Finally died all curled up in a ball. Then he came after me. I shot him too, right in the leg. He cried more than the dog. <laughs> Gonna have a hard time playing football on what's left of that knee. You think it's okay to kill people? You need help, Eddie. <laughs> Don't get a holy on me, James. This town called you too. True. You and me are the same. We're not like other people. Don't you know that? Let's party! God damn it. There we go. Sorry, Eddie. Eddie? I think he's dead, James. Eddie? I... I killed a... a human being. Well, it's kill or kill, be killed, frankly. A human being. Can I at least take his gun? Mary. Did you really die three years ago? Can I take his gun? No, it doesn't look like it. Damn. Right, it's... Another one of those. Go back to the shotgun for a bit, I think. Oh, well, see you, Eddie. No, nothing that way. Well, at least it's daylight again. Ooh. Yes. Definitely use that. Thank you. Shipping dock. I think we might be getting close to the end. Because I think this ends at the hotel. Oh god, I remember this going on forever. I need to head towards the light. There we go. No, going the wrong way. There we go. If I remember rightly, this takes a while, so I might just skip through this bit. So I don't think anything really happens. It's literally just rowing. A rowing simulator. Yep. Finally. It was just a rowing simulator. 
But we're here. We should be at the hotel now. This place hasn't changed at all in three years. How can you tell? Always the fog always here too. Right, let's explore the grounds quickly. See if there's There's a fountain in the shape of a bird. No water is coming out of it right now, though. Okay, so, but what's this? Got the little mermaid music box. Okay. Okay, so... Checking the grounds was a good idea. Made it to the hotel at last. Waiting for you in room 312. All right. So that's the lobby. See what's in here. Anything's hanging here, there's nothing unusual about it. So why were you looking at it then? Oh no, you're looking in there. Uh, Mr. James Sunderland, the videotape you forgot here is being kept in the office on the first floor. Oh yeah? The key to room 312, the key to the room where Mary and I stayed. Oh no, that's where I came through. Alright, lock's broken. Lock broken, fair enough. Can't leave. What's this? There's a rectangular indent indentation. There's a place in front of the indentation and something is engraved on it. Seat of the princess who awoke from death. That doesn't sound quite right. Ah, right. I need two other music boxes. Okay. I'm not going to go upstairs yet. I want to check out these other doors down here. Okay.
Come on. I want to make sure you're actually dead. Thank you. Oh, what's in here? Yay, lots of bullets. Thank you. Anything else? Right, let's check these doors. Broken. 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 Alright, cool. Nothing else in here. Excuse me. Eight or two here. I probably should check the map more frequently. Restaurant. Okay, cool. Something over there. Got the fish key. Spooky piano. Oh. Did I scare you? Little yeah. little shit. You're here to find Mary, aren't you, James? Well, have you? No. Is that why you're here, too? She's here, isn't she? If you know where she is, tell me. I'm tired of walking. I wish I knew. But she said it in her letter. What letter? Wanna read it? But don't tell Rachel, okay? Who's Rachel? Who's Rachel? She was our nurse. I took it from her locker. <laughs> All right, let's see what this letter says. My dearest Laura, I'm leaving this letter with Rachel to give to you after I'm gone. I'm far away now in a quiet, beautiful place. Please forgive me for not saying goodbye before I left. Be well, Laura. Don't be too hard on the sisters. And Laura, about James. I know you hate him because you think he isn't nice to me, but please give him a chance. It's true he may be a little uh, surly sometimes, and he doesn't laugh much, but underneath he's really a sweet person. Laura, I love you like my very own daughter. If things had worked out differently, I was hoping to adopt you. Happy 8th birthday, Laura. Your friend forever, Mary. Ah, I see. Laura, how old are you? Um, I turned eight last week. So, Mary couldn't have died three years ago. Could could she really be here? Is this the quiet, beautiful place she was talking about? Me and Mary talked a lot about Silent Hill. She even showed me all her pictures. She really wanted to come back. That's why I'm here. Maybe you'll get it if you see the other letter. The one, Mary. Huh? I must have dropped it. Laura. I gotta find it. Laura! There are a lot of letters. Drawing done by Laura. A cat? There's a piano here. I remember how much Mary liked to play the piano. What? She wasn't very good. Oh, for God's sake. But I still love to hear her play. That was so long ago before we were even married. Why am I thinking of that now? Good question, James. Whoa, hello. Okay. Oh, there's some stairs there that I didn't check. 
Stairs in the lobby as well. And there's a save point in there as well. So let's deal with this thing. Uh, I'll try this. I want to see how much damage this thing can do. Oh god, there's two of them. No, I don't want you to open the map. Alright, that's not going to work. Get off! Where did the second one go? Okay, got both of them. Never mind. Oh god, I keep pressing the wrong buttons for some reason now. Oh my god, I've forgotten how to play this. What's wrong with you? Oh Jesus, that took a lot of health. Alright, we'll bag one of those. Alright, so I've got the key to room 312 and a fish key. That's on top of the restaurant on the table. Okay, nice. Uh, switch back to the pipe for a bit. Where was it? It was over here. Cool! And with that, I'm going to end this episode here. I do think we are close to the end game. And I'm questioning whether we have time to jump into Silent Hill 3 next. Because as of at this time of recording, it's exactly two weeks before Village gets released. So I don't know if I'm going to have time to play through Silent Hill 3 beforehand. But we'll decide nearer the time. But for now, thank you very much for taking the time to watch this, guys. If you liked it, like, subscribe, ding that bell. I've been Sigma Later. This has been Silent Hill 2, and I'll catch you next time. Take care now.